everyone, it's me, Alex the Rambler. Today, we're back on Hearts of Iron 4, and I'm back on the Star Wars mod, Project Valacord. It's been updated to a 2.0, so I thought I'd give it a try. Now that it works, it was crashing, but it doesn't seem to crash anymore. So let's do it! So this is the mod that kind of sets it all into, um, well, space! And it has a whole map, a whole galaxy map. Uh, full of planets, galactic empires, the huts, you got everything that you could ever dream. Uh, and we have very a variety of interesting countries. Now, last time I played as the galactic empire, you do have all of the others to pick from if you so wish. But I think that the ones with the most content uh, is probably Alderaan. So I'm going to play as Alderaan and see what we can what we can do, how, what we can, who we can have fun with as Bale. All right, Bale. How are you doing, mate? So a core world renowned for its people's pacifist and compassionate nature, Alderaan has been a safe world for many who have been the rebellion ever since the formation of the Galactic Empire itself. The most prominent figure is the wife of the planet's queen and senator, Bail Organa, known and respected across the galaxy by critics and friends alike for his honesty and commitment to justice. Bail Organa is the perfect representation of the Alderaan spirit. But will Bail Organa's commitment to honesty and justice cost the galaxy its freedom? <gasps> who knows? We've got steadfast pacifism. Oh, I'm not sure I'm going to like that. We have the Rebel Cell, which is pretty nice. Gives us extra weekly manpower. Very nice. We've got Alderaan Monarchy. And then the variety of things that we can do. But uh, let's begin and see if we just die straight away, eh? You've been looking for Hearts of Iron tips in Alderaan places. Oh my goodness gracious me. So, uh, we start with six divisions. They're all going to be like civil brigades, aren't they? We actually have OK Generals. So we'll get Balderon Holt. I'm surprised we even have anything like that. Oh, and there's Carlist Reekon. Oh, it's Reek. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know him. Very nice, very nice indeed. And we have the Alderon Defense, the, 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 the Alderon Defense Fleet, which can be led by oh, Antilles. Sure, it's not Wedge. I think that's his daddy. Destroyer leader, Lance. He got captain, a blockade runner. Yes, they've changed everything around. That looks pretty cool. And what do the troops look like? Actual rebel troopers. And I presume if we just get our fleet out, will it actually look like a pro? Oh. Yes, it does look like a proper fleet. Oh, that looks awesome. But to begin with, shall we stir the Senate? The Empire has gone unchecked for far too long. We must begin to push back through the Imperial Senate uh, so as to try to enact meaningful change. There we are, because we are in... Oh, we have many market access. So let's start with electronic mechanical engineering, basic machine tools, and construction one. I wonder what sort of... Oh, I have no idea what sort of brigades they're going to be, but I imagine they're going to be pretty terrible, aren't they? Are they all royal brigades, I wonder? Crews are standing by. Crews are standing by. Frequency over. Awaiting command. Constructing. Now that is from Empire at War. Hidden base. <laughs> we do have a neglected military and steadfast pacifism. I should probably try and get rid of that at some point. Let's start off with getting some convoys. Let's get an early destroyer. So we'll start to get a small fleet, but it won't be anything that can deal with the star destroyers that we're going to potentially encounter going up against the Galactic Empire. Oh, and then there's the Imperial City on Coruscant. And then we are Piddly Alderaan. Oh, they've got the Hapes, Hapes Consortium. What do the factions look like? It's just the Empire, I think. There's the Empire and Free Ryloth. So you've got people that are trying to keep their independence, but against the might of the Empire, can they? Oh. Why on earth do we have Crate? Oh, Alderaan has multiple planets. Huh. I wasn't expecting that. But off our little ship goes. Is that like the Millennium Falcon? Whee! Oh, there's also Jabba's palace over here. Oh, 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 oh Jabba. Do they have a... No. No custom focus tree there. Uh, we do have the Mimbanese Liberation Army trying to fight for its independence. I'm sure the pal Palpy Palps will uh, get that under control. I really wasn't expecting to have like three planets. That's interesting. There's the Mon Cala uprising. Hopefully that will trigger can hold a senate debate why not current state empire low control okay we've stirred the senate very good formalize the alliance in the senate the alliance to restore the republic okay or shall we do the legacy of the delegation of 2000 or we can protest imperial moths no let's create the faction let's create the faction first oh and we can actually do assassinate imperial officers we can do a recruitment effort if i want to so it's all about doing the inevitable uprising but i could keep holding debates and propose a senate bill what sort of ships could i research i probably want to research the venator class don't i so i can get some heavy ships maybe i really have no idea this is what happens when you're just playing the mod for the first time and having a hoot i think i'll raid supply depots 
in Mon Cala hold more Senate debates. Just spending all my PP on things that I may not need to do. But anything to weaken Palps. We gotta we got we gotta weaken Palpatine as much as possible. We'll grow the seeds of rebellion. Yes. We'll replace resistance cell with rebel cell. We'll get extra weekly manpower, production efficiency, max air, support current production cost. Lovely. Palpatine, he's gonna try and have power. We'll try and stop him from having it. But uh at the moment with one military factory producing some equipment. We're not looking too too hot, I don't think. I was hoping for some extra units, but maybe I should just develop the Royal Fleet first. Get some extra naval dockyards. Navy, naval dockyards are building? We'll, we'll, need, we'll need the... Uh-oh. Gorman shipping line, lanes debate. The brewing crisis over Gorman has finally boiled over. Amid the open spat between the planetary and galactic governments, new reporting has revealed Imperial naval vessels blocking critical shipping lanes to the planet. Uh-oh. Well, let's see if we can do something about that, shall we? I'll start a Senate investigation. Yes. Who's in this protector's base? The protectors. Oh, you have the Mandalore protectorate. But really, the Galactic Empire is just getting planet after planet after planet. And I am feeling a little, um, suffocated. I don't know how the rebels are meant to survive here, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll give it the good old Rambler try. Let's begin uniting the rebel cells. I would have liked it if there was the text to go along with it. But we'll get, we'll get, we'll, 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 we'll. We'll get it, we'll get it. All these, like, small planets belong to the Galactic Empire. How many belong to the Galactic Empire now? Oh, okay. Most of the world, most of the galaxy. Okay. Maybe I want extra troops? Let's train a few more Royal House Guards. Who knows what they'll be able to do against Imperial Stormtroopers? Probably not a lot. Now we can confront the Imperial Senate. Not sure that's the best thing to do, but uh, let's think about getting some trucks. And radio, civilian train or support equipment. I think we'll go for support equipment and towed artillery. So we're a disarmed nation right now. We've got civilian economy that I can't change. Oh, we can get C-3PO, human cyborg relations. Oh, I could also get an imperial demagogue if I just wanted to join the empire. But uh, where's the fun in that, eh? I'm going to assassinate an imperial officer. And we'll also hold a senate debate, maybe? Or propose a senate bill? The senate remains one of the best ways to covertly work against the empire and could prove to be more influential than one may think. Yeah, let's see if we can just overthrow Palps. <laughs> just like that. That'd be funny. Okay, so in Coruscant, proponents of galactic liberation gather silently at the steps of the Senate building to protest the recent actions of uh, the Imperial Security Bureau, with some dissenters claiming that the government's organisation was practising an overreach. <sighs> Let us hope for the best. Infamous Admiral Radus. Radus becomes a naval commander. Yeah, let's do that. We'll get some Admiral Rass Radus in, won't we? And the concerns go unheard. Okay appears to have gotten involved in our demonstration against their overreach. The protest was quickly shut down, with many involved being bribed or threatened into silence. Hmm. Despite this setback, more senators are slowly beginning to question the Emperor's authority. Good. Well, at least we can keep doing that. Let's start a Senate investigation. We'll keep trying to undermine that. I think that's what this playthrough is going to be all about, really, just undermining the Senate. Then we do have the Mon Cala uprising coming. The Citizens' Revolt. I wonder where that is. Will I be able to see? Oh. Dream toss on Q8. Oh, 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 I think you're gonna die. Oh no, the, oh look, it's blown up all over the galaxy. There's tons of citizen revolts. That's what you like to see. Yeah, let's do galactic wide surveys then. We have total Senate control, I believe. So that's good. I'm not sure what sort of effect we're gonna get from that, but. Aha, we now have the uprising on Mon Cala. Okay, and where are you? Oh, the citizen's revolt has almost been put down anyway. I've forgotten where Mon Cala is in the galaxy. In the top right. Ah, thank you. Well, let's see how that goes. It'll probably just be crushed, right? Oh, I've created my own faction, the Alliance to Restore the Republic. It's not very large. We haven't really got a big, uh, a big faction here, or at least not one capable of taking down the Emperor. While our base on Yavin 4 is more than suitable for our needs right now, we should look into secondary bases. There are thousands of systems. Okay, I think we'll have Radus becomes the Chief of Navy or Jan Dodonna. Hmm. I think if we're sending an envoy to Mon Cala, then it would help to have the hammer. So we'll get General Radus. Radus becomes the Chief of Navy. Okay. His bold and blunt approach appears to have already had its effect, with broad changes having taken place in mere days. Oh. Oh, he doesn't like to retreat. Okay. Well, let's do the envoy to Mon Cala and see if we can get some Mon Calamari Star Cruisers. Oh, should I get Leia in? I think I've got to, just for the sake of it. Potential site on Hoth? Yes. We'll have a backup. We need backup for the backups for the backups. Mon Calamari have pledged their support. Ah, 
Ah, thank you. I guess we'll have to do an alliance with Saw. Saw Guerrera? Do we really want to have that, though? We will not stoop to his level, so I'm going to condemn the radicals. Yeah, and we'll do alliance loyalist funding. I'm not embracing the partisan methods. No! Oh, Mon Cala ships. The Mon Calamari fleet is tied down, preventing Imperial sorties into their sector. If we can secure a buffer zone around their homeworld, we can free up our ships for you. Oh, I need to control. How on earth am I meant to do that? Do I justify? Not that I could justify. <gasps> They broke free! The Mon Calamari are free! Good for them. Let's go ahead and form the Alliance to restore the Republic. Let's do it. Let's do it! How many planets do we have again? We've got like three planets. But we are now the Rebel Alliance. Do I want to recruit Admiral Akbar? That's the that's the thing. Of course I want to recruit Admiral Akbar. Let's recruit Admiral Akbar. How do I even get Mon Mothma to become active? That's the thing. Should we do diplomatic envoys? So I don't really know what I'm doing with this tree. Uh, I'm just hoping for the best. But we do now have own one which is essentially one battleship oh yeah there it is there's there 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 it there's that bad boy there's that bad boy akbar becomes the chief of navy i wonder when the empire is going to do anything i haven't really seen them do a whole lot i'll declare the rebellion establish the research division there's so many focuses oh they're just okay they are declaring war on people oh, should i be scared of the palpy palps coming in with his star destroyers or his death star and just annihilating me probably can i do a whole lot about it right now no. Okay, I'm going to grow the ragtag fleet now. It really is a ragtag fleet at that. We won't last long against those Star Destroyers. But we will last longer against... Oh, that rebellion didn't, didn't go too great. Woohoo! We've got more of a ragtag fleet now. And a fair amount of troops as well. So, the Citizens Revolt was annexed. Oh dear. Let's do the Carillion Treaty. Yeah. Okay, all rebel cells to join the rebellion either by merging or joining our faction. Kashyyyk joins our faction. So does Moncala, the Corellian Resistance, the Spectre Cell, the Massey Group, Kota's Militia, the Shalandrian Resistance, Free Ryloth. So my faction has grown to multiple planets, including Mon Calamari, which has its own fleet. Oh boy. Oh, this is going to be so much to manage now. Um... Yeah, loads of free stuff. Almost an overwhelming amount of free stuff. I know I'm complaining a little bit, but you go from nothing to everything pretty quick oh the citizens revolt has happened across the empire again is that just going to keep happening i'll take it if it does unfortunately it's not going to be enough to really do a whole bunch here negotiations with kota let us engage with the general honestly honestly and constructively okay we'll see if we can maybe invite naboo to the faction meeting with the queen why not i have no idea if naboo is still at war but uh i guess we'll figure that out when we get to it although i think they've already joined so we'll just expand the movement which will give us extra decisions the kingdom of naboo Okay, the Citizens Revolt has exploded again. Are they going to keep getting those all the time? Because they never have any tri- Oh my god, look at the Galactic Empire's troops. Jeez, the freaking wheeze, son. Rise up, rise up, it's time for the rebellion! I still don't understand how you're ever going to be able to challenge the power of the um, Empire. Especially maybe if they start to get a Death Star. And I'm kind of surprised that I, I could just justify, but I, I don't think that would be a very good... Hopes are built on hope. Territory liberation operations? Maybe? There's so many focuses, guys. So many focuses! And the Citizens' Revolt has occurred again. Scavengers come up empty-handed. Uh, I'm sorry, what? I'm at war now. But I don't know how the Wookiees are going to hold out for very long. Everything is collapsing. I don't think I've done this very well. I think I kicked off everything way too soon. Is anyone else, like, confused at how that war kicked off? Oh my god. Look! Look at what I'm against! How do you- how, 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 how are you meant to overcome this? I'm almost out of fuel, too. How do I even get fuel? Wait. <coughs> The enemy AI is far better than I thought they were going to be, and I am clearly not prepared for this at all. Oh my god. This is actually legitimately awful. What have I done to you? Alderaan, I'm sorry. Rebellion. My divisions were trash. What can one rebel do against so much hate? I think that's in my entire, uh, my entire army that's about to die. Oh, farewell, brave fighters. There's been a mining incident on Jeddah. Just don't worry about this massacre of rebels, that's fine. I almost want to get destroyed by the Death Star. So I've lost Alderaan. That was my main planet that I built everything on. I did not expect to lose Alderaan that easily. We controlled a few planets. <laughs> but they're all really spread out. Uh, I don't know what to do. Our capital's now at Hanna City. Okay, they've just dis- uh, They've got rid of the Senate. The Senate has been destroyed. Oh, democracy. 
awful, awful democracy. This feels like a game that's going to result in me getting blown up by the Death Star, and I'm kind of here for it. Oh, um... The Imperial destruction of Alderaan has shocked and angered those throughout the entirety of the Rebellion. The planet's citizens were always sympathetic towards the Rebel cause and did everything they could to assist the cause. The planet's destruction will be forever missed by those throughout the galaxy. Okay, so may we honour their deaths. Cariso, Sam, Leland and Tom Sher, Jenkin. Oh, oh god. Okay, so they... Uh, Alderaan's been destroyed. I lost two million manpower with the fall of Alderaan. Oh... Oof. Ryloth. Oh. Well, down goes Ryloth. It doesn't appear that I'm a natural rebel. I don't, I don't know about you. Oh. The Empire is really striking back, yes. But we're going to go... Uh, I'm going to try and naval... <laughs> See if we can uh, cause some damage to their convoys. So I have increased supremacy over them, but I'm unable to get superiority. Friendly ships have orders to engage 130 against theirs, but uh, we can't, not really sure how to solve that. Am I really unable to naval invade Korlag? Because then once we've done that, we can go after Coruscant. We can strike back through the power of the, of the chonk, maybe? I've got the chonkers today. Little, little chonk. I, so I'm not understanding why I can't get naval superiority, so maybe someone within who's smarter than me can can tell me low enemy intel oh oh and i happen to be out of fuel as we start engaging their fleet <coughs> me sideways with a wrench well i won i feel like um this mod is amazing i just don't know how to play it very well yet oh come on how many empire op empire op a rebel victory! Obi-Wan Kenobi's leading the strike back. And we'll be in striking distance of Coruscant. Not sure what would happen if we took it. Let's try and cut them off from supply. They naval invaded behind me, even though I have convoy raiding on and operational. And we're getting pushed back by Imperial troops. I'm about to be cut off. Absolutely destroyed one of their fleets, though. Oh my god, I have 4,000 planes just not doing anything. Alex, why are you so silly? I don't think it's going to be enough, though. Let's go and... Oh, no. So, I'm doing a general, general Grievous strat of just um, going to Coruscant. I'll demand galactic recognition. Oh, I can actually do the invasion of the core. Unlocks New Republic decisions. Uh, does the Empire have an overwhelming advantage, did you just say? E yes. Everything of mine has basically crumbled and the Empire continues to rise. Back our fleet goes, I think, to dock. I have... I... I... I any ideas of what I could be doing here to improve my chances? Because I am feeling pretty screwed right now. Let's see what. Let's see how the rest of the focus uh, goes, though. Let's see. Let's see if we can somehow get victory from defeat here. Like I still have several planets. I think is that the alliance to restore the republic? Yeah. So we still have some planets, but a lot of it has been taken over. Oh, we can get Jin Erso. Okay, we've recovered Jin. I'm going to try and recover Galen Erso. Yeah. All right. Sure. Let's do all of this stuff. Okay, Galen Erso has said he should be able to assist in rebel research efforts. And we've got Rogue One. Sure. Let's hope we made the correct choice. In order to recover plans to the Death Star, which contain the supposed fatal flaw described by Galen Erso, a large group of rebels have taken upon themselves to participate in a raiding party to the Imperial planet of Scarif. Captain Andor, Jin Erso, Admiral Radis, and uh, Antok Merrick have also gone. Okay, I trust her with my life. Let's dispatch Princess Leia to Scarif. Volunteering to receive and transport the Death Star plans from Scarif to our base on Yavin 4, Leia and Organa of Alderaan will be accompanying rebel forces on their raid of Scarif. Despite being advised against the move to the dangers of the mission by Senator Bail Organa, she is determined to transport the plans. May the force be with her. The Yavin Gambit. Are we going to get the... Ga we, 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 Oh, I can just remove the Death Star? Say it ain't so. Where's where's the Battle of Yavin gonna be? News from the Yavin system shocked the galaxy today of reports from Imperial forces in the system indicating the destruction of the DS-1 mobile battle station. Numerous high-ranking officials were reported to have been aboard the station, including Moff Tarkin. No official statement from the Imperial Navy has been released, but the lack of appearance from Grand Moff appears to all but confirm these reports. <sighs> Do I try these naval invasions again? Let's try again. Let's, let's try at least. This is working a bit better. Oh, sh <sighs> me. Every time I think I'm safe, 
I'm actually going to try and invade Coruscant. Ahsoka Tano. We're going to get Ahsoka Tano now. What the bloody hell? Like, you get a load of cool people. I think that there should be a way to trigger rebellions, maybe? I am so confused. Not confused. I, I think I'm having trouble looking at the map and discerning, like, what's the best targets and where to go and when, you know? Oh, they've invaded Korlog immediately. Bad, 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 bad. Like, we're taking it down a decent number of their troops. It's more just I'm unable to achieve much else. They don't have any manpower, which is nice. Oh, no, I lost this again. I mean, luckily I have manpower and they don't. Like, I feel with... If I was playing the Stellaris version of this, I feel like it would be... I feel like they could actually start invading. Like, your allies don't do a lot. I think if we started getting the revolts that we had at the start of the game around now, that would really help overthrow the Empire, I, I, I think. What's Operation Tyrant? A plot to work with a defecting Imperial officer to steal one of the Empire's most iconic representations of oppression. Hmm. Okay. I wonder how long our little troops here can hold. Oh, it's Ahsoka Tano's army. We're just going to have to hope to hold to get supply. A fine addition to the fleet. We've got an Imperial Star Destroyer. Lovely. Oh, no. No. Hold on, Ahsoka. Do they have any manpower yet? They still don't have any manpower. They're just insanely uh, OP. But if you look at the amount of planets we're meant to try and conquer. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. So we've done an invasion of the core. So we'll take a look at what those decisions do. But I think that this is as far as I can get. Oh, now I can get Mon Mothma? But what are the decisions? Oh, I need to control them all and then I get cores on it. That's all it does. Have I lost this planet again? So I can destroy their fleets. Got that going for us, which is nice. Somehow they're still beating my troops, though. I think my troops are terrible compared to theirs. They have Stormtrooper Legion. I think I've just really ballsed up the Rebel game here. I've really ballsed it up. Do they have manpower again? If they have manpower, I think it's over. They still don't have any manpower, so they're not replacing anything that they're using here. I just can't touch them. Uh, we'll take a few units down there. Uh, Ahsoka can try and move out again. I can't believe I've lost this one, you know. I didn't even invest in any um, anti-tank, did I? I'm sorry if this is a bit of a disappointing play for everyone. I just don't really know what I'm doing as the Rebels, I'm sorry. I feel like I'm kind of stuck. This mod has brought me to the, the, my knees. But maybe we'll defeat the- they've actually got ATAT models. That's really, really, really cool. That's really cool. No wonder I can't destroy them. If the manpower law changes for the Imperials, it, it, it's completely over for me. Yeah, okay, they've changed their manpower law. They have manpower. Oh, dearie me. Oh my god. So, I- uh, I think it's time to call days on this little playthrough because it's it's not really gone to plan, but it has shown off the rebels. I think I've made some major mistakes probably fairly early on in this playthrough that's brought me to this point now. Oh, dearie me. I'm sorry, everyone. I was hoping to bring peaceful times with the rebellion. I was hoping to maybe naval invade the the planet, the, the Imperial planet again, but I, I, I think I'm too stretched. Oh, Mon Cala City is now my capital. Ew. Oh, probably because I lost the city. Yeah, I think I'm no match for a Atat. Vader's Hellcats were trying to fight and the Emperor's Fist. Yeah. Well, there we go. That was my little attempt at seeing if we could get the Empire to win. Maybe we can finally take back Hannah City. Pew, 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 pew. The, the atmosphere on this mod is absolutely incredible. Well, I took back my city. I don't know. What do people think of the mod? I think it's absolutely incredible what they've made. Uh, I just wish I was a bit better at it. So unfortunately, this will be goodbye from the Rebels for now. But if you've enjoyed the video, of course, please do comment, like and subscribe. If you've got any tips or tricks for me, let me know because I certainly need them. And maybe I'll play this mod again. But until next time, everyone, I bid you a very, very good day. Bye-bye. Many thanks to Duff Bowl, Jack Troku, Chancellor64, Haigu, Logan Whaley, Salty Badger, and Wyatt Green for being cult leaders and champions of the Patreon. And many thanks to all the other patrons, Twitch subscribers, and YouTube members too. Thank you.